What is going on guys? It is Vibrant here. Today we are back for the first episode of Minecraft Survival Games. And today, um, well, this is the first episode of Survival Games. And I know I kind of got mad on Minecraft before, but, you know, I started playing Survival Games a little bit recently. And I've been doing alright with it. Um, and in case you want any texture back, I'm using this Kurt Coe's default edit. If you want the link to it, just ask in a comment below and I'll send you a link. Um, ask if you want the link to the video or the, um, just the text back download because, you know, you never know if I'm just giving you a link to some random bullshit just because people will probably do that. I won't do it, but you just want to be, uh, careful on the internet. But anyways, so, today's topic is going to be the, uh, defensive players. Now, uh, for those of you that don't know, MCSG and Battleline are full of defensive players. It is like crazy you know there's everywhere and you know there's full and like this is how defensive players will play all right all right so, so let's say i'm like probably around full chain ish all right and this guy's a full iron i'm like oh hey what is up and uh so i started you know i just like yeah sure i'll fight you i'll just lose and he's just like he to turn around and just goes bo 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 full and steel run 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 bo Bo, 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 full and steel. Run, 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 full and steel. Got it. Once I got him in full and steel, I'm gonna run some more, bow him, eat a gapple, then I'll go in for the sword. You know? <laughs> and and it's like, when I do a bad line 1v1s, that happens so much. It's like the worst thing, or just like, bo, 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 you know? And full and steel, and full and steel, you know? You know, like a rod is like non existent anymore. And, yeah. And I did have to play defensive. And um, and like one situation on this uh, game, like this the gameplay you see, and that's just because he had better gear than me. I do understand if you play defensive, someone has better gear than you. But if I have even or worse gear than you, I'd say defensive is just kind of ridiculous. And this is what I don't like about an MCSG. It's unbalanced. Offensive players will lose against defensive players unless it's a good offensive player and a bad defensive player. You know. And, like, mostly offensive players can't really push that well. And I understand we play defensive against a team or something, but still, you know? Like, defensive is a part of MCSG, and now everyone's, like, exploiting it. And it just kind of ruined survival games. And it's just annoying. And I don't like it much. Like, I'm not a- I don't really- I'm not a good of any type of player, in my opinion. I'm not really a good offensive or defensive player. And, uh, I'm just kind of in the middle. Like, I'll play defensive if they're a better gear than me, and I'll usually just play offensive. Other than that. I'll, I like using my flint steel, though. Bow! I'll use my bow for, like, a couple of shots, but I'll, like, I'm not gonna be moving in with my bow. I'm not gonna be going outwards and running. Unless, you know, I'm, like, full leather. He's, like, full iron, you know? You kind of understand where I'm coming from? <laughs> just saying. Just saying. But, uh, yeah. So... Yeah, that's, that's just the thing I dislike about MCSG, and it's kind of just... Oh, it's crazy. And it's, there's so many of them, too. It's not just the occasional guy who just plays really, really defensive. It's just everyone who plays really, really defensive. And one thing I know is B-Boy QG, like one of the really good peers, is a head-on defensive player. And, yeah... Like, you don't usually deal with defensive players. Like, what I do is, uh, like, let's say they're doing battle line one ones just flint steel. Bo, bo, bo. I'll just, I'll just go in the other side of the map. He's like, alright, dude, how about you just come over here? Yeah, 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 that's right. I'll just wait here when, when you're done with your bullshit. That's, that's kind of what I'm like. And in uh, actual survival games, I usually just kind of sit back and, like, like, once you deal with defensive players enough, you'll be able to predict flint steals, which is something good. And hopefully you dodge arrows, but you never really can. It's annoying, because you, you probably have to use a lot of gapples against all their bow shots. It depends on if they're good with a bow. I'm pretty shitty with a bow when I try to play defensive, but other than that, I'm alright with a bow. And, like, one example was this guy, um... So this, so the, this guy had, like, basically iron boots, chain leggings... Gold chest plate, gold helmet. I had a leather chest plate, nothing else. I had a stone sword, a rod, and a bow with two arrows. And I shot one arrow at him, and he started running away. I didn't clean him up or anything. No, there, there's nothing like that, because it was pretty early in the game. And he starts running away, and he goes, Bow, 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 flint steel, bow, 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 flint steel. 
and then he turned around and rod come on me. And I actually got some pretty good hits into him, but uh, obviously I did lose. Like, I just decided, yeah, screw all those, go for you. You know? Because I wasn't really, like, he already took my route, so I wasn't gonna you know, be any better. But yeah, so I hope those tips helped you in, like, playing on here. I'm just gonna cut this thing out to the fights, just so you can see the fights, and yeah, enjoy.